thanks for joining us today. We're back in the studio with Susie and Kendall, and we're going to talk about the song Pour It Out and the upcoming release date. So stick around. jump in and talk about the song pour it out uh this song was brought to us by kendall originally and uh we all kind of pitched in and and helped her out with it but i'm gonna let her start off the conversation okay it's so funny because you know susie and i laugh about this but this idea for pour it out literally come to me in one of my my best um most <laughs> creative <laughs> my create my creative Jesus flow because I'm in the bathtub. It, it literally came to me in the bathtub. That's about the only time that I get peace and quiet in my house. So um, I do do a lot of singing and just thinking and praying in the bathtub or the shower. So um, yes, and then she sends me the uh, audio <laughs> clips of her in the bathtub, and she says, "What do you think this sounds?" And she'll sing a little bit of the song, and then I hear. <laughs> it's true. It's true. Some really great ones have come out of that though. Um, but but seriously, Pour It Out is is an awesome song. It when I had the idea for Pour It Out, um, we you know we've been praying about revival for so long. We've been wanting a move of God for so long, and so Pour It Out is kind of just a declaration. It's kind of prophetic, saying, "Lord, pour it out. We see it coming. We receive it." Um, we claim it. We speak these things. So um, it, I think it's really an awesome, powerful song. As a matter of fact, one of my most favorite lines in Pour It Out is, um, Christian, sound your battle drums. The time for victory now has come. And I think my, that's something that you had line. on your mind yep. for a really long time. Yep. Because Kendall would come to me and say, I'm working on a song, and I don't really have a lot with it, but I just know it's something about Christians sounding their battle drums. And yes. you said that for a really long time yes. before the rest of it came out and came with you. I did. Yeah. It, it's, it's a battle song. It's a victory song. You know, so many songs, um, so many Christian songs can be solemn. They can be sweet. They can be this. I wanted it to be, like, victorious. I wanted what the Lord's going to pour out on us, what he's going to do for us. And so I'm, um, I'm really excited for you for you guys to hear it, for sure. And the, the music of this song kind of takes on the embodiment of that because Absolutely. right when it says battle drums, the, yep. drums, are, the drums are doing yep. that, that type of thing. Yep. And uh, it, it just really you know, adds yep. to the, to the yep. feeling. And I know that I can come to Tommy with pretty much anything and say, hey, here is what I'm hearing, and here is what I'm thinking, and he puts music with it just like effortlessly. So I knew when I took it to him with a certain tune in mind that he would be able to put the music with it, and, and I think it flows so well. Um, even, you know, coming to them with uh, that night that I come to them and said, okay, here's pretty much the finished product, but I don't have a bridge for it. Um, I, you know, we sat there, and, and that's where you kind of yeah. Come we into sat play. there for a while, and I, you had a couple verses, I think, in the chorus, yep. and that's what we had. And we just probably put the music to it, and we just kind of sang through it several times, I think, that yep. night, and just kind of got the feel for the song. And the bridge just came to me while we were all sitting there singing and talking and worshiping. So the Lord just pushed it right from my brain out there and right. um it just gave it the little bit of extra that the song needed because the bridge talks about um falling fresh on us that we want it to rain we want your holy spirit yeah. to rain in this place and to fall on us we want to receive that um <clears throat> how you're in the end it says you know yours is the victory yeah. so again yeah, it flowed with the idea that i had for the song of, mm -hmm. of it being a victorious song yeah. and then we even changed up the drums in that part yeah. um we wanted it just to sound a little bit different, and so we added a little bit of a different uh, beat, or however you want to call it. I might not be saying that right. I'm not the drummer, but <laughs> just a little something different to it right. um, in that part of the song. So I love it. I love this song. Absolutely. It's a fun one. It's, Absolutely. It's full yeah. of victory and full of declarations, <clears throat> but it's a lot of fun to sing. And it, it, I, I do have to tell you a funny about the song, though, because for the longest time, Tommy heard this 
let's change the beat of it. Let's change up the beat of it. And and I was like, okay, how are we doing this? So for the longest time, he would want to come in at a certain part. And that was so weird for me to get that even in the studio, when we went to record it for the album, they're literally sitting there to me as I'm trying to sing it. And they're going, we're counting. One, two, three. One, two, three, go. One, two, three, go. One, it was two, three, the hardest go. thing for me to get to come in at that time because Tommy had this idea of what he wanted. And, and, well, and it, you had one thing it, in mind. Absolutely. Yeah. And it, but it, yeah. I'm so glad we did it the way we did because yeah. now it flows and I can't imagine it being any other way, honestly. Yeah. So, it gave yeah. us a lot of laughs doing it like absolutely. that. Too. Absolutely. Absolutely. It poured out. It's a great song. It's a victory song. It's a battle song. It, it's all these things. It's like I said. It's a declaration. It's prophetic, and we cannot wait for you guys to hear it for sure. Yeah. yeah. And our album release. We're so excited about you guys mm-hmm. coming to that, um, where you'll hear all of our new songs again. I'll say it like I did last time. If you want to hear our hearts, then listen to this album because this is. I can speak for them. I think when I say that this song is is what we want the what we want to see, what we believe the Lord's doing. Um, it's the cry of our hearts, honestly. Absolutely. So album release night is Friday night, April 28th. Um, come out and join us and worship the Lord with us. That's what it's all about. Yes, we put out an album. Yes, it was a lot of hard work. And yes, it was a lot of fun. But everything is to the glory of the Lord. Absolutely. So it's just a celebration of him and singing of his, of his goodness. So come on out with us and worship that night. Absolutely. Doors open at 6.30 and we start at 7. We cannot wait to see you guys then. Okay, guys. uh, Don't forget to like, share, and comment on Facebook. If you like what you're seeing, that helps get the word out for everybody else. And if you're on YouTube, you can uh, like us there or subscribe to us. And also, you can hit the notification bell. And then join us on Instagram on our MVM Worship page or our New Vision Ministries page. Please like, share, and follow us there. We'll be putting, um, we don't post the actual video there, but we will be posting um, the link to our YouTube videos.